How's it going, everybody? Uh, Anonymous Disco back here with Bug Snacks, actually. If you can believe that. They, uh, they brought out a free update uh, called the Isle of the Big Snacks, I'm pretty sure. And I figured, uh, figured why not? Hey, he's trying to eat my munchies. Yeah, stay out of those. All right, anyways. Um, yeah, so it's it's a free update, and uh, I don't know, we've uh, already played Bug Snacks before, and I... Uh, uh, buddy, I got something to show you. Get Follow me. <laughs> Um, but I think, um... Uh, Chum, I need your help with a matter of grave importance. Yeah. You see, my seismic readings have been off the charts today, and I fear something terrible is happening just off the coast. Chandler and I are headed to Simmering Springs to investigate, and I'd be greatly reassured if you could join us. Sure, let's go. Oh, splendid! Meet us there whenever you get the chance. In the meantime, we have preparations to make. Chandler, ready the sunscreen! <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna have to get reacquainted um, with uh, the controls a little bit here. It's pretty self-explanatory. Nice Wambus, yeah, it's all coming back. Anyways, we played Bug Snacks before. I really enjoy it, actually. I think it's a fun game, especially one to um, play on uh, on the channel here. So, anyways. Um, from what I remember reading, you had to talk to uh, Snorpalicious there to to uh, meet Snor Snorpy in Simmering Springs. Okay, so just getting back, getting acclimated again. So I'm in Snacksburg right now. Simmering Springs is the the beach one, so I think it's out this way. Philbo, you stop looking <laughs> at me with those eyes. Ta-da! It's your very own mailbox! Lisbert was gone most of the time, so if any of us wanted to get in touch or give her something that wasn't too important, we'd just leave it in here. And since you've kind of taken over Liz's job, I'm sure we can do the same with you. Beats waking us up in the middle of the night, right? <laughs> oh, and what's this? I think you might have a letter right now. Go ahead and check. Um, yeah, man. Dear buddy. Thanks for walking me back home, and also for saving me from the brink of starvation. I figure since you'll be staying in Snacksburg for a while, you might need some basics. Here's a care package with everything I could scrape together. I hope you find yourself at home soon. Best wishes, XOXO, Mayor Philbo Fiddlepie. That's me. Oh yeah, he's mayor. Okay. Well, what do you think? That's all right. Were you reading that over my shoulder? Oh, sorry, I, I just thought it'd be more fun if I read it out loud. But um, I guess that defeats the point of leaving a letter. Uh, yeah. hmm. Where am I gonna keep this stuff? Man? Great question, buddy. And that leads me to part two of Operation Gift Buddies. This way! <laughs> I was thinking you could keep all your new gifts in your very own hut. I know it's kind of a fixer-upper right now, but hey, at least it's open plan, right? Oh, that's a nice, cool <laughs> update, so we get to build our own house now. <clears throat> anyway, uh, this hut really was meant for you, and I know we're going to finish it someday. So keep checking like your mail, feel do some right redecorating, now. and before Dorito. you know it, this will feel <laughs> like home. All right. Toggle build mode. Oh, so cool, man. So I wonder, I wonder how this works exactly. Like, do you collect stuff out in the wild, or maybe you like unlock things by doing other quests, perhaps? But these are locked right now. It's not looking too, uh, too great right now. We have a dandelion and we have um, a broken shelf. So. Uh, <clears throat> We'll we'll do some investigating because I definitely wanna I wanna build the house. This is I, All right. It's good to be home, stranger. Feels like a fresh start. If you're ever fixing to grow a farm yourself, here's something that ought to help. A scarecrow. Oh yeah. 
Hey, Betsy. Thanks for convincing... Bestie, sorry. <laughs> yeah, because your bestie's with her. Hey, Bestie. Thanks for convincing me to come back. I forgot how nice it is to have a real bed, lol. Since I'm not camping out anymore, you can borrow my old sleeping bag if you want. Befaka. A lantern? Thank you again for helping me and my little ones get a better home. I sent you a lantern in case you also get real scared of the dark. Charwe, Joey, and Ashwe send their love. Gramble. Mm. Aloha, darling. It looks like we're neighbors now. Well, I hope you'll accept a token of my appreciation for earlier. May this light, uh, may this be the light of your life and inspire you the way it inspired me. Hanging lights. Wiggle. Hi there, I thought you might need this map to help navigate the trickier trails of Snacktooth. You know, it feels kind of weird being back in civilization, but I'm happy for it all the same. Feel free to stop by and chat any old time. Triffany. <laughs> this guy, I like, I like Crumdol. He was one of my favorites, actually. Um, Crumdomart is back in action. It's all thanks to you, pal. You can find and close one uh, script, uh, subscription to Crumdo's gratitude plan. TM trademark. <laughs> Put it outside to show your friends how much you like. I like you, and because I'm such a generous guy, your first month is totally free. Crumdo, thanks, buddy. <gasps> Bro, thanks again for helping me and Snorpy come home. I found a lot of choice wood up on the mountain so if you ever need me to swap out your paneling you let me know red cedar we're gonna have the whole house built but because i finished all their quest lines and stuff already so i've got all the stuff greetings chum i'm having a fine time in snacksburg thanks to your efforts i thought i would give you this random gift of news and foils because it makes for a great installation and not because it blocks out a certain wavelength of the mind beams. Yeah, I like um, Snorpington as well, Snorpy. Yeah, he's he's a really funny guy. Neat. Oh my God, we're getting one for everyone. Oh, thanks for the help. All right. Oh my God. Oh, yeah. Mm. Look at all this stuff I'm getting. <laughs> oh. Ah. Neat. <sighs> Oh my god. I'm pretty popular, eh? So I guess you probably get it like for doing certain things. Like some of those sounded like like when I beat certain quests, some of them were like when I just got them to Snacksburg they gave this to me. Hey buddy. Buddy, I need your help. I was strolling through Snacksburg when I slipped on a banoper uh banana popper. <laughs> Sorry, and sent to my sack of laundry flying. It stuck up high. Could you help me get it down? I can do that. Capture all bug snacks and flavor falls. Oh, all right. Rustic bed. Oh my god. Oh, yeah. Lost track of them. So these are just giving me extra quests now, too. Listen up now. Holy moly. Hey, buddy. Listen up now. Alright. That was a lot of mail. But we uh we got through it. What should we have out front? I think we should have... I like the palm tree. That looks kind of neat. You know, I think... I thought it looked neat. Scarecrow. Call up uh, Cillian Murphy. Christopher Nolan's Batman. Because I got a Scarecrow. Um, Let's have... I'm either thinking record player or ham radio. Those kind of neat. Let's have the record player for now. Um, family photos, group photo, map of snack tees, lantern. It's the group photo. Isn't that sweet? Where am I? I. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not in this. I'm not in this. You know, I guess uh, I guess I'm not a part of the town, eh? Some uh, oh, whatever. Whatever. Grumpus skull's kind of neat. 
Oh, sweet. All right. Um, this one's still locked. Um, loose newspaper. That's awesome. Sauce rug. Money print rug. Still have the rustic bed. I kind of like the loose newspaper, honestly. And let's have, um... This one jar's kind of neat. I wonder if you can put, like, different stuff in it, too. I kind of like the ham radio, too. So it's still, like, a beat-down shack, but, uh, I don't know, we can probably, like, I don't know if we can kind of upgrade it a little later on, get a little more rock, and get, like, some second floors. That's a really nice addition, though. It, uh, it makes a lot of sense in a game like this. I just love how, like, I know, I love the world, I love how simple it is, but it's also, like, it's very identifiable, it's, it's chill and fun. All right, but anyways, I think this... So we're going to be heading to Simmer and Sprangs. Look at all this mail. Isle of Buzz Tax Side quest. So would these go into side quest? Or is it like mail now that... Phantom... Could you scan a honeybee with a ball stuck in it? Stuck to it? So yeah, these are little like side quests and stuff. Probably get to stop for your house, maybe. But anyways, let's head to the Isle of the Big Snacks. Cause I, I that's something I'm gonna have to see. Uh, yeah, so anyways, we're going that way. Shake it up, Simmering Springs, all right. Like I said, I'm gonna have to re-familiarize myself with how to play a little bit, um, but I don't know. I'll I'll uh, I'll get uh, reacquainted pretty soon. Notice this game is actually on Xbox now, and I was I considered downloading and playing on my new Xbox, but um, I'd have to restart it and play it again. Which I don't mind, but I just kind of wanted to get at it for the sake of the video, you know? Like, so, I, I figured. So yeah, there's certain snacks. Maybe I'll just try to ca try to catch a few snacks out here. I'm getting back in the swing of things. Sorry, it's just it's been a it's been a hot minute since I uh trip shot, sauce slinger, snack grapple, lunch pad. Yeah, so if we went over to a fellow like this. Okay. 
curious, Snack likes to dig things out of his hand and bring him to his lair. Can't remember how to catch him again. I know how you would get him in there because it, it's your ball thing right so you gotta get your buggy ball oh. well I got the crabble anyway but I think another way you can do it is you get the buggy ball and then you um Okay, I'm feeling pretty re-familiarized. Oh, yeah! I always wanted to have a beach party. Need me to sunscreen your back, Snorp Dog? No, no, no need, Chandler. I'm well protected. I can tolerate the horrible sun for at least a few minutes. You sure? I could check if you missed a spot. <laughs> Best to keep our wits about us. This seismic event could happen any moment. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, what was that? They're not usually this intense. An anomaly, to be sure. But it ended surprisingly quick. Oh, oh, oh. oh my god. It's a new island, dog! We gotta go over there! Uh, must we? Uh, um, yes, of, of, of course. Uh, but, but surely this job is bigger than the three of us. We need to form a miniature expedition. A gathering of our finest scientific minds. Of course, that means Triffany and... Floofty. <laughs> Ooh, get Shelda, too! Shelda? Well, she's hardly qualified. You said you want the finest minds, and Shelda's loaded with wisdom. Bam! Team assembled! Oh, I suppose she is an herbalist and the closest thing we have to a doctor without Eggabel around. Very well, tell Triffany, Floofty, and Shelda to come to the and beach. Maybe Shelda question stay mark. Here to prepare a way across. Get hype! Alright, boys, alright, lads. I will be back momentarily. To the bird, snacks bird, snacks bird awaits. I forgot how good the music was in this game too. It's really fantastic. Forgot how long the loading screens were too. And it's so different now that I've been like rocking the the Xbox, the next gen Xbox. And uh, it, the loading screens are like a lot quicker. I don't know about this game specifically, but just in, just in general, loading time is is much faster in, in the next gen. Bro, come check this out. <laughs> Filmo told me you were living here, and I thought, you know what this place needs? Walls. <laughs> it's my bad for not finishing it in the first place, though. I was gonna have it ready in time for you, but then all that stuff happened. But sooner or later. Chandlo gets the job done. Enjoy your walls, dog. Thanks, buddy. Uh, you know what? I did really need walls. Now this place looks pretty spiffy, honestly. Looks pretty spiff. 
All right. There he is. Hello. Oh, I thought he was sleepwalking because that's the only way you can Yo. feed him. Like, Yo. That's great when you feed him and he's like, he's like sleep eating. He oh, thinks he's hello. sleeping. Um, I like her head is the heart. Let's make, um, uh, let's make both the right feet. Can we hold them? Oh, neat. Yeah, that looks good. That looks good. Yum, yum, yum. Intriguing. Oh, that's good. Well, it's very, looks good on you. Anyway, sorry, I need to talk to you. Do you want to join our expedition? Hmm. So an unknown piece of geography has erupted from the ocean, unexplained and unstable, likely to sink again at any moment. So of course I'm going. I will gather my equipment. Cool. Good. And I like your sense of adventure. Yo. Hey, buddy. All right. Ah, another fine day behind us. All right, Triffany, Triff, Triff. Tombo, this is my place. Wiggle, Befica. Hi. Befica, that's such a funny name. Yeah, there's, is it, that's, is, I can't tell, is that Triffany? I think it is. Wayman's where's the hat, yeah. They've, they've, they've been so far gone on the snacks, I'm just not, I can't recognize them anymore. Do you want to join our expedition? You better believe I do. Islands don't just pop into being every day, you know. I got no business left here, so I'll go on ahead and meet you on the beach. Ding dong. Whoa. You're asking me? <clears throat> Well, of course, your need for guidance is great. Despite the peril, one will show you the path. And that scary little island. If it's what I think it is, there's something there I need to see. Yum. Cool, all right, well, we're good to go. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Yeah, alright, well, well when when we get back to see this snorp, then we'll be able to get to the new island and uh that's the thing, I, I it was my buddy was telling me this. I, I'm I I I, I take it that there's some new snacks on the island too. I would assume Gosh, Boys, everybody's ready for the expedition. Ah, so soon. We're not quite ready yet. We could use another few days of assessment. What are you talking about, Snorp Dog? We got the raft ready in record time. Let's go get everybody. <sighs> of course, Chandlo. All righty. I'm here and ready to explore. <laughs> Triffany's great, too. Ooh, nice work on that raft Alrighty. there, Chandlo. Thanks, Brophany. Indeed. If it is not more than a finely crafted tomb for the foolish wanderers. Of course, Snorpington can get volunteers. Ah, oh, but it seems a vagrant has wandered into our expedition. Snacksburg is that way, Shelder. <gasps> Be still, your wicked tongue. One must show respect to one's elders. I will respect you as soon as you do something respectable. No, you think so highly of yourself that you alone are they who can know the unknowable? No, you bring ruin to all that you touch. Ruin to Egabel, ruin to Elizabeth, ruin to your own flesh and blood. I'm starting to think this might not have been the best idea. You know, six folks is a lot for one raft. Maybe one of us ought to stay back home. 
Which one? Ah. We're all going. Me and Snorpy can hold it together. Actually, Chandler, uh, well, I was thinking you and I should stay here and supervise. What? Bro, why'd I build all this stuff if we're not going? Don't you want to know what's on the new island? Well, uh, of course I do, but look at that thing. That island is a death trap. Come on, Snorp Dog. It's probably fine. Look, I gotta go out there. They need me. Yes. Somebody this game gets me so hungry too, man. I haven't even had Shut any it. yet. You can go if you Just must, like, Chandler. Looking at that burger on I'm Chandler's staying head, here. It's like, fuck. But bro, we do That's everything cute. together. What if something happens to you while I'm gone? Me? Well, I'll be on this lovely beach. What if something happens to you? Yes, yes. You can both be struck by a meteor at any moment. Honestly, they do this every time Chen Lo goes to check the mail. Can we stop wasting time and get on with this expedition before I'm as old as Shelder? <clears throat> you two are like mirrors, reflecting endlessly. One must look away from the infinite abyss and gaze down only at oneself. What? Whoa. Far be it for me to give anyone life advice. What? But there's nothing wrong with a little time apart. It's healthy, even. All right. If you all say so. Don't worry. I'll be in radio contact the entire time. And I've got trackers on at least three of you. Right. Okay. Then let's get this party started! He's right. Right. Oh. Bro, I'll let you do the honors. Just jump on the raft when you're ready. <laughs> oh, I'm ready. Oh, it's okay, Chandlo. Snorpy's gonna be fine. Time apart is healthy. All right, chum, if worst comes to worst and you're surrounded by grumpinati agents, shout <laughs> the code word and I will set off a flashbang hidden somewhere on your body. Don't worry, it should be perfectly safe as long as you don't say the code word at any other time. Good luck. All right, perfect. Thank if you. If one is fated to brave a den of inevitable tragedy, one would prefer to do so in better company. This group is a little uh, volatile, but I'm sure we can put our differences aside for the sake of learning. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I love As her. As usual, voice. it is up to me to do a majority of the heavy thinking around here. Let us not be distracted by interpersonal dramatics when a cacophony of scientific curiosities has been dropped in our laps. What? Speak English. Set sail. So yeah, I'm assuming there'll be some new snacks, maybe some variations, maybe some stuff we haven't even seen before. I'm not uh, exactly sure what to expect, but uh, I'm excited for the new challenge. I'm excited for the new challenge. Like I said, I uh, getting used to the controls again. Uh, when it comes to some of the more complicated snacks, I'm sure I'm gonna have to, you know, we'll get in there. We'll figure it out. You know, we'll get, communicate. Um. Yeah, I think we'll use All right, Snorp Dog. We made it to the other island. We found some kind of reef cove thing to land on. Chandler, listen to me. It's very important. You need to understand that the remote detonator. <laughs> Snorpy! Oh, Grump, the radio's broken. No, no. I think we're just out of range. Or there could be some interference going on. Oh, how unfortunate. I suppose we will have to proceed without Snorpington's so-called supervision. But maybe we Are should they go brother back and sister to too? It'll forget. only take an hour. The threshold is crossed. It cannot be uncrossed. And if you think I'm spending another minute on that plank of wood today, <laughs> you are dead wrong. Yeah, you're always right, Shelda. Snorpy knows we got this. He'd want us to keep exploring. Huh. Looks like there's a way across up there. Let's check it out, bro. <laughs> Did 
two steps onto this island and I'm already seeing evidence of ancient Grumpus technology. Ooh, ooh, this trip is definitely gonna be worth it. Despite one's years, there ever remains a sense of humbling beauty where sand meets sea and not a toxin in sight. Hmm. These coral structures are the only animal species I've witnessed anywhere near the Snacktooth biosphere. Intriguing. Do we need to light that thing up? I bet Snorpy's trip shot could do it. All right. <clears throat> Just give me a moment. So I think you have to... Nice. Last one across is a rotten eggler. Oh, slowpoke. Guess you're a rotten eggler, eh, buddy? Well, Your words that you night. <laughs> Some kind of ancient maze carving. With moving parts and everything. Well, whoever built it put it directly in our way. Chenlo, you excel in brute force. Destroy this. You got it, floof dog! Call me Floof Dog again and see what happens. <laughs> now hold on, hold on there. Let's not go smashing the priceless antiques just yet. Looks like you could fit your buggy ball down there in the entrance. I bet if we solve this maze, something real interesting is gonna happen. <laughs> Be amazed. to mention the water damage. If that's just the door, who knows what historical goodies we'll find inside there. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. I wonder if there's a map specifically of this place or not. Broken tooth. Even see evidence of civilization from who knows when. Oh, check out that impressive looking temple up there. One is more concerned with the ominous crater that lies beneath. If my eyes do not deceive me, I believe I've spotted new varieties of bug snacks as well. New bug snacks? Sick! Think they could be dangerous? There's an easy way to find out. Well, uh, before we get too ahead of ourselves, we might want to set up a base camp. A wonderful idea. One could use time to uh, recenter. Five minutes in, and you already need a nap. Leave the labor to the protective members of society, then. Oh, please don't start this again. Rose! Come check this out! You seeing what I'm seeing? It's bunger time! Excellent. Why don't you go and fetch it for us, Chenlo? Way ahead of you, dog! Oh dear. You better go follow and help him out. We'll stay up here that and start setting up here. That bunger is <laughs> pretty bunger. Pretty big. Pretty big. It's pretty. It's a big bunger. Wait, is 
it just me? Or is that bunger way bigger than normal? Bro! Whoa, what are you okay? Ooh. Bunger Ow. Royale. My muscles and my bones. Where am I? I hit some kind of statue room. Looks like she's holding a thing. I don't know what that is, but try throwing it at the big bunger. Maybe that'll do something. Oh, it's a bomb. I am a bomb. Well, it takes a while to go off. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Whoa! It stopped being big! I bet it's small enough to catch now! Okay. How do I... Oh, I need the net for him. Oh, I think I have to, like... He has to run into something and get kind of, like, woozy. He likes ketchup. You gotta run him into this Yeah, because it's definitely ketchup it wants because they put the sauce over here. Oh my god! <laughs> Got big again. Alright, sorry. So I'm gonna have to do this again. Then I have to recollect how to catch the bong. Because I think you have to like r make him run into something and then he gets like. But I remember doing it so there was two of them and they would run into each other. Um. But anyways, I'll work down here. Maybe I gotta trip him. Must have to trip him. Think that's gonna hit him? I don't hit him. Hey, there we go. Hey, hey, Bunger Royale. I got a Bunger Royale. All right, bro. You got Bunger? I got hunger. Now, Bunger me, bro! Now, Bunger. He's so bungered out, man. Look how much bunger this guy is. I guess we should just keep with this whole bunger thing. Let's make his body bunger. Yeah. Uh, it wasn't quite as exciting as I hoped. So good! That's a whole meal in one bite! We gotta tell the others about this! Plus, I should probably help unpack. Did you all see that? Giant bug snacks! Even the bungers out here are as big as Mama Melon! Gosh! We might be witnessing a prehistoric species somehow preserved at the bottom of the ocean. I'm getting so uh -huh. <laughs> That would align with my theory on the correlation between age and size. 
The lost sister of Snacktooth lies unburied. Yet you marvel at the engorgement of the toxins that dance on her grave. The lost what now? Tell me, Chenlo, how did you come to capture this specimen? We found a jar of some kind of small dust. It came out of this old lady statue thing. A statue, eh? What did it look like? Like a big friendly grumpus lady with flowers all around her. Uh, no. That sounds like it could be a shrine to Mother Nature. Whoa. Shelda, that's your thing. No, 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 no. Ah, but why would Mother Nature, no to despiser of bug snacks, be dispensing bug snack catching equipment? Hmm? Shelda, your god is a hypocrite. Silence, you wretch! The mother guides! The mother protects! If you so doubt, then one will wield the light of truth against your blasphemy! Okay then. I guess Shelda's gonna go check out those shrines. Uh, meanwhile, I gotta go take a look at all the ruins around here. There's so much ancient history to uncover. I'm giddy just thinking about it. I am fascinated by this shrink spice and its effects on snack matter. If I can determine exactly what it's made of, I'm certain we will have much use for it. All right, bros. I know I'm not a scientist, but I got a hypothesis. If this island can make Big Bunger, can it make Big Chandlo? That's not what a hypothesis is. <laughs> Honestly, what does my brother see in you? Oh, hush. I'm sure it's worth a try. Well then, let's get to it. <laughs> All right, there we have it. All right, so I think uh, well, that was just dipping our toes in the aisle of the big snacks. Um, it's good to be back with the bug snack. Um, we'll be, I'll be back soon. Maybe, I don't know, we just sit down just do a big old session of it. Or maybe we can just do it in kind of small bite-sized pieces. I'm not sure yet. But this game, as it always does, makes me freaking hungry. So I'm going to go order myself a Bunga Royale. And, uh, and I hope, uh, you guys have a great night. Um, thanks for watching this video, though. Like and subscribe. And, uh, yeah, we'll be back more bugs soon. Bug snacks very soon. Bug soon very snacks. Alright, see you later.